What's up guys, Nintonic here, and welcome back to our episode of Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we enter, I think this is 608D, and uh, I think this is like Tetra Cavern or something like that. And, um, or Tetra Mountain, I don't really know. <laughs> to be honest, I don't even know where we are. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, we um, basically just went here because you're supposed to do it. Really was no indication. Uh, we did have this battle with um, a uh, giant skeleton monster uh, on a bridge, and we uh, gave some jerky to the army to help um, to help us, but they really didn't help us, like most NPCs do. Like it's it's really true. Like there's no real, there's no such thing as like a helping CPU. They usually just either mess up or they just are really bad. All right, so I think we kill that guy. Yep. So off screen, I did do a little bit of battling because I kind of had to end the episode quick so I wanted to do that and um after doing so I just we just battle a couple times and then that was basically it and I just found a save point pretty close by alright so it looks like we're supposed to go in here I think alright got a little kid on the win whoosh Yes, you are, kid. <laughs> Stop! Are you here for the... Masumi... Mas... I can't... I, this is like the legendary sword of the game. I just cannot pronounce it. It's like Masamune? Ma, 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 Masumune? I don't really know. I'm just gonna call it the sword. <laughs> Thought so. Wait a sec, okay? Oh, big brother... Where are you, Maz Maza? Do you mean Mazda? Mazda, zoom, zoom, zoom. <laughs> what is it, Moon? Not again. So, you want to get a name for yourselves by grabbing the sword? What a buffoon. Humans are so silly. It's how you use the sword that's important, not who owns it. You can't even understand something as simple as that. That's why you're human. What should we do? The usual test them. You can entertain us for a while. Alright, here we go. Whoosh. Alright, so they're not little kids. They're like... Some goblins. So it's Mase. And Moon. Which I don't really know if they're supposed to represent anything, but yeah, I don't know what the weaknesses are either. But it looks like every time you attack them, they do an X strike. Let's see, can I get a combo here? What's a good combo? Rocket roll or fire punch? Let's go with fire punch on the blue guy. Like he's not really a blue, but he has like a blue neck tie or whatever. Alright, nice, I did a lot of damage. So it looks like combo attacks can't be countered. So I'll do that again. Alright, they made a uh, robo dizzy. Alright, they're gonna use fire whirl even though I can't attack both of them. I think the blue one's weak to fire and maybe the Red one was supposed to be weak to ice, but I don't have Marl, sadly. Should probably switch her out pretty soon. Alright, let's just attack uh, a blue one and then the red one. Alright, he's gonna use. Okay, so it looks like when I attack the red one, they counter attack with X Strike. 
But if I attack the blue one, nothing happens. That's what I think is happening right now. I really wish uh, Robo would snap out of it and actually heal someone. Maybe I have to attack him to knock him out. Can I not target him? Alright, well it doesn't matter anymore because he got hit and now he's back to normal. But now Luca is in chaos. At least that's why I think the, uh, I forget what it's called, the disability or whatever. I really don't know what the name of it is. Uh, let's go with Cure Beam on Chrono. Heal some HP. Alright, let's go attack the blue guy again. I mean, the blue guy should be dead. I don't know if that's Masa or Moon. Okay, well, it looks like he's dead now. Just like as I was saying it. Oh, okay, and I guess the red guys too. Hey, they're pretty tough. Alright, so Moon I beat. Only Cyrus made it this far. What should we do? This time is for real. Alright, this is it. Yeah, we mean business. With Masa's braver, braver, bravely, bra I, I can't even speak. Moon's knowledge. Alright, so just how like the skeletons combined the last episode and made a giant skeleton. This time we have two tough uh, bosses combining into one. Two become one. And here we have Masse and Moon. Alright, so uh, I'm gonna have. No, Cure Beam. Uh, let's go heal Luca. Luca, use fire. Hopefully, fire is effective. Okay, looks like it is. But yeah, this guy is pretty tough. If I remember correctly. Let's go with Slash, see how much damage that does. Alright, didn't do much damage. I'll do Lightning next time. Okay, uh, Robo, go ahead and heal, uh, I guess Luca, because it looks like she's in trouble. Alright, not that bad, I guess. Let's go with healing Robo himself. Usually I just heal people that are at the lowest amount of HP, so that time just happened to be a uh, Robo. So it looks like he's weak to, um, okay, never mind. I was going to say he's weak to magic attacks, but looks like he might only be weak to fire attacks. Because that fire, that fire did a lot of damage, to be honest. Unlike the um, lightning that didn't do that much. Let's see what regular attack does. Okay, regular attack actually does a lot of damage. But I guess that he counterattacks because of it. I love how Masa and Moon is like just like staring at Robo with his mouth wide open, just like ready to attack him. He's like, come at me, bro. <laughs> Alright, uh let's go with Cure Beam. We gotta do it on uh Chrono. And then we're gonna go fire. I just love it, it's so funny. He's just like, come at me bro, Robo. You know you think you're big? Well look at me, I'm bigger. And then whenever you attack him, he's like, what did you just do to me? I love this guy. Oh no, not y Oh shoot, not this attack. That literally did so much, di that killed Luca in one hit. Alright, this is really bad. Like, that did a lot of damage. I think that did like a hundred to each of them. I think even more than a hundred. Alright, nice crit by Chrono. We need another healing for uh, someone. Okay, uh. 
I might actually have to use it on Chrono. Because he just got hit by that giant whirl attack. Alright, hopefully Robo doesn't get attacked. I swear, if he does that yes indeed thing again, I'm going to be so mad. Okay. Uh, this is bad because now Robo doesn't have that much MP left. And same thing with Luca. So he might have to sacrifice a turn or so. Nice crit. Oh no, wait, is he using... I think he's gonna use, uh... His ultimate attack again. No! Are you kidding me? This is so bad. I, I don't think I can be survive. Alright, I'm gonna use a mid tonic and then I'm gonna start reviving people. This is really bad. I don't even think I can like and Robo's so slow too. Alright, I'm gonna revive uh Chrono. I think I'm I'm missing something here, because I think like when he says pain, every time you attack him he counterattacks you, but also he uh oh, I can't even do that. I have to get an ether. Or use an ether. But every time I attack him, I think he, like, charges up his counterattack for the, uh, yes, no, what? Are you kidding me? I just revived everyone! That's such bull. I literally just revived everyone. You know what? Maybe Robo's just gonna have to do the finishing attack. Or maybe not. I don't like that move is just so powerful. It kills all of us in one hit basically. And now I'm back to where I uh, hey guys, what's what's up guys? It's Tell Nick here and we're back with another episode of Chrono Trigger back, you know. Didn't do anything off screen. Uh I go get this chest again. Yeah. Didn't miss anything in the last episode. We just got to do all those things over again. I really do hate these types of games. Like, I hate games that, like, you have to, like, save, and then, like, when you die, you have to go back to the save point. It's so annoying. <sighs> I have to fight these goblins again. Yay. I love how they interrupt me. And that every attack has to annoy me so much. <sighs> okay, let's try this again. And the thing that's really annoying is that I have to fight against two bosses basically. Gotta fight against Mase and Mune, and then you have to fight against Mase and Mune, which is different. You know, you have Mase separated from moon and then you have Masse and moon together yeah somehow it's different alright gonna go heal everyone up cause like you can't heal again like once you beat Masse separated from Mune, or Moon, I, I can't even say their names right. Alright, we have a power tab, I might use these things now. Do I have a magic tab? I think I do. Yeah, I only have one though. Wait, what did it say? Magic plus two? Oh, magic star. Uh, maybe I'll switch up the items. I'm gonna keep the power glove for Chrono, but I'm gonna give some fast thing to uh Robo. Is there anything that fast? No. 
I know, uh, yeah, the bandana increases, uh, speed. Maybe I'll put a counterattack for someone. Maybe for Chrono. Oh, wow, okay, actually, Robo has a pa more power than, uh, Chrono does, so maybe I'll just put a, uh, Maybe I'll do Berserker too, cause like he really doesn't need to use lightning. Yeah. Oh wait, no, actually, that thing. Okay, never mind. That doesn't lower it that much. Um. Yeah. Let's just go with that. I mean, Chrono levels up after this, so like, I don't really get why. Uh. Still doing so bad. Like, am I under leveled? I don't think I am. I mean, I have a good amount of. I have a good gear I bought. Actually, did I? Maybe that's what I messed up on. <laughs> Forgot to buy gear in the uh, market. Maybe I'll do that off screen, but it's a long, long walk. Alright. So that Berserker actually comes in pretty handy. In my opinion. Alright, let's go with Fire. And that guy. Let's go with uh, Rocket Punch on Blue Guy. Which I think is what? Moon? I think it's Moon. Nice, Chrono. All right, let's go ahead and use fire. Okay, so the, so the Berserker is actually working out pretty well. And I'm just gonna punch myself right here so that I can get out of chaos. But of course it goes in chaos before I can do that. Oh wow, okay, that actually killed him. Nice. And then a lot faster than I thought it was. Okay, so now they're gonna combine. And if I lose here, I'm just gonna... Literally, it's just a waste of an episode, but... I really don't care, you know? I got better things to do. Like, I'm not being, like... Like, I'm saying, like, my channel's not really important, but, like, you know, I tried my best, so. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'm gonna go with Fire, because it's very effective against him. Super effective. Uh, let's go with Cure Beam, start healing these people up, so that when it goes yes indeed, it won't be so yes indeed, I guess. <laughs> Alright, the dude did a good amount of damage. Nice. Gonna go ahead and heal uh, Luca. Alright, Luca actually doesn't have that much HP. Alright, why couldn't I have used it after he did that? Alright, so I think he'll start doing yes indeed pretty soon because we've been doing a good amount of damage all right you slash on robo or not robo chrono i'm gonna go ahead and heal luca and i'll heal chrono next turn or next time uh robo is able to move freely hopefully he doesn't die from yes indeed Alright, she's gonna get slashed there. Ooh, wow, that did a lot more damage than I thought. No, I didn't want that to happen. 
Alright, hopefully he doesn't counterattack that, because if he does, Luca might die. No, alright, Luca's dead. That sucks. Like, that's so annoying. He counterattacks while you attack, and then he does this super powerful move on everyone that you can't even stop because like I didn't even attack him the time when I was like reviving everyone with Robo but yet wow are you kidding me right now are you are you serious are you serious right now I just revived her let's try this again so maybe berserk wasn't a good idea <laughs> All right, who's dead? He might die, actually. All right, uh, Chrono's still alive, surprisingly. Gotta go heal him up, though. And Luca's dead. What the? How did that hit Chrono? Are you kidding me? Okay, game. Okay. All right, I'm gonna let him do the yes, indeed. It'll just hit. Robo, which is good. But then I have to heal myself again. This is just a hard fight. It really is. Do I really have to heal myself again? Is he gonna be able to attack me again? Yes, he is. I have to heal myself again. This is so stupid. This is literally the worst fight ever. I hate it. Oh my god, do I have to heal myself again? Or no, okay, no I don't. <sighs> I'll revive Chrono, he has a fast speed, so he'll be able to attack, I guess. Do some damage. But then die. Okay, not immediately. Uh, he just said pain right there, so... He's gonna use that, yes indeed. And kill, uh, Chrono. Or before that, 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 that works too. You know, I'm going to keep doing this, just so that, uh... Alright, I have to heal myself. But I'm going to keep doing this, just so that, you know, Chrono attacks, and then Robo just keeps healing. I mean, but sooner or after, I have to use the ether. Wow, really? This guy does way too much damage. I literally hate him. There has to be some way to take out... Maybe I have to use lightning to take out, uh... His, um... To take out his soaring energy tornado thing. Like, maybe that's what I have to do. Wow, okay, I actually killed him there. So, one hit... Wow, okay. I bet you he was at, like, 1 HP. Alright, well, uh, sadly, Luca didn't get any experience, but Robo leveled up, at least. He deserves it, though. He's the MVP right there. MVP of this episode is Robo. Alright, they beat us, big bro. That was fun. Will they fix us? Will they find us an owner? Yeah, it'll be alright. So, yeah, I think... Luca is pretty underleveled. Yeah, I mean, she's one level under, but it's not a big deal, I guess. Alright, let's take the sword and get out of here. Looks like a power tab now. Or a magic tab. So... The Musume is not just a myth, but it has long been broken. You got the broken Musume, or the sword. Still no name of it. Alright, allow me. We'll ride the wind to the base of the mountain. Good luck to you. Thank you. I appreciate it because, like, the walk down this mountain is pretty annoying. Alright, so uh, I think I'm going to end things there. Thank you guys all for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more Chrono Trigger. 
right here on Town Deck. Bye.